a whole new world, a whole new world out. Welcome to another review of The Walking Dead Worlds Beyond. I normally do live streams of this, but unfortunately, the live stream, YouTube be tripping, man. YouTube be tripping. So a brother like me has to improvise, okay? So today's recap review is the episode called I'm on, I'm on the Boat, all right? Or On the Boat, all right? And this episode was an introduction to Elton, all right? His backstory. And they done this... Um, they done this uh, episode differently versus the other episodes of World Beyond when he introduced the four characters. Uh, there, there were flashback scenes, but to me, the flashback scenes in this particular episode, it didn't jive with the present uh, day scenes. You know, uh, I don't know what happened. Maybe they had a new producer. Maybe they had somebody else directing it this particular episode. But this particular episode was different from the previous episodes, all right? Uh, this is an introduction of Elton, his backstory, and how he became the young man that we see today in The Walking Dead World Beyond, Beyond Worlds. I done told you guys a multitude of times, I do not like the title of this show. And I'm surprised I'm watching it this long. But I gave you my reasons why I'm watching it because of the backstory, the four main characters, and how the four main characters don't realize this, that they are connected, all right? So uh, Elton, and spoiler alert, spo spoiler alert, even though I'm not gonna talk uh, too much about the episode because, you know, they're, you know let's, let's, let's just face facts. There's a lot of people out there that are saving up these episodes and they're gonna watch them at a later date. All right, so this explains uh, Elton's backstory, how he was with his father. His father was, uh, uh, if, if I can uh, say this without butchering it, he was an, uh, an archeologist. Yes, I said it. Uh, and uh, he, he likes uh, collecting uh, pieces of the past and investigating them about how important they were and how they were used in the past. And he was working at this museum. They didn't go into details of did he own the museum or what he was he the lead, but he lo he loved his work, all right. And it also uh, introduced Elton's mother, and at that time she was pres uh, pregnant. So. Basically, uh, you, you see how the family bond with one another, Elton and uh, his father and his mother. And you can tell uh, between Elton's mom and father how it was sort of like how they was going to do things as far as raising their kids. Elton's father didn't want to hide uh, life. He wanted to show life for what it is, and his mother was kind of laid back. She didn't. She don't mind uh, Elton learning uh, about life, but she was going to take it uh, on a slower pace and leave certain things out. You know that she was viewing Elton as a little child, and she was coddling him and treating him like a, a baby, all right? Which a lot of mothers look at their kids, no matter what age they are, if they're six or 16 or 30, there are some mothers out there that view their kids as children, even though they haven't been a child since, you know, you know, you can't call, that's, they'll, they'll say, that's my baby even though my baby is, her baby is paying card notes and things of that nature. But Elton is like 13, 14, uh, but still, you can tell she coddles uh, Elton a lot, all right? So she, uh, she has to go somewhere 
and he warned her about the dangers. And I feel like that when 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 uh, uh, the dangers of the area she was going to go to. And I feel like overall, Elton's mother, she really she perceives the world with rose-colored glasses, and that's the reason why she treats Elton uh, Elton like like a child, all right? Because her interpretation of life, she don't look at the reality of life, all right? She don't take everything uh, for account about life. So you can you can clearly tell the father was going to you know tell the kids about the whole cold the cold stone truth about life and how she wasn't going to do that. She was going to wait at a later date to tell him the other half about life. So she goes uh, to this um, this part of town and at that time there was radio, radio reports of a lot of strange things going on uh, uh, around the world. Fast forward you, uh, uh, fast forward uh, the outbreak starts his father hides him in a box Elton in a box and uh, his father is just as scared as Elton but he was trying to um, he was trying to basically tell Elton there's nothing worry there's nothing wrong with being scared and he's not scared even though he was, you can clearly tell Elton's father was scared of the un, of the unknown. And you know, any natural person and, uh, in those unique circumstances, everybody would be scared at that point, all right? So he was trying to paint a picture and, he, and when he did that, uh, it kind of harbors me back to, well, maybe you know, he's not this person that in the beginning, you know, he was just uh, really uh, dressing himself up to be uh, this forward person uh, who's not, uh, who's going to tell you the truth, the whole truth and nothing but the truth. All right. Maybe he was putting on a persona and maybe he's just like uh, Elton, just like Elton's mother. All right. See life through rose colored glasses in that uh, standpoint. Now, also in this episode, uh, the other two guardians that's watching the four kids uh, made a pack with Elton to see if Elton can um, discourage the other uh, three kids turning back, all right? And one of the kids, uh, uh, Hope finds out because she hears the conversation, but she also hears the, the, the other guardian saying, you know what? These kids may have a point. Maybe we should, um, maybe we should move forward and see what's going on, all right? So now the other guardian is having doubts. So uh, the male, the, 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 the guy who's the guardian of hope and the other girl, he's getting, uh, uh, dis he's getting discouraged, all right? Because everything is not going his way. And in the meantime, they still have to deal with zombies and surviving, all right? So I don't want to uh, keep on talking about the episode because I want to respect the people who haven't watched the episode uh, to finally watch it and see it from their uh, viewpoint. Now, overall, um, when you look, when you, okay, overall, you learned a lot and, and, oh my God, I said this in the live stream. I want to watch this uh, Words Beyond because I want to see how the how these four uh, kids finally realize or come to conclusion that they all are connected together. Even though they don't uh, physically see it or uh, when you talk about their timeline. And... Um, Elton was sitting at the fire looking at a picture and Hope came along and she started talking to Elton, uh, basically saying he had, you know, he, he had to do what he had to do, make saying that, you know, everything's cool with, um, 
with with you and the rest of us because you had to do what you had to do, you know. And what I mean by do what you had to do, partying, uh, partying, uh, being a partying, woo, being a you know partying up with the two guardians. All right. So as she encouraging Elton and uh, just being there for Elton, Elton's looking in this book and he's looking at a picture of his mother. And then um, a few seconds later, Hope looks at that same picture. And then Hope realized that's the same woman that she supposed to shot, uh, uh, shot with the gun, shot with the gun. And I'm kind of skeptical with that too, because if you look at that episode, it just doesn't even if it, it even if it went off accidental it, it just doesn't jive or add up all right so now hope's aware that elton's mother uh she shot so supposedly shot elton's mother all right and now uh you know is is hope going to tell her sister about this if is, is she going to um uh step up and tell Elton about this and how Elton's going to handle this news. Because remember in that episode, they was calling him a Benicant, a Benicant Arnold, they was uh, calling him a traitor, you know, uh, you know, a backstabber. They was calling him all these things uh that he had no honor. But at the same time, you're calling this guy all these names. And uh, now you got the proof, the evidence in front of you that the woman that you shot at was Elton's mother. And I'm skeptical about that as well. All right, so how all this is gonna play out, I don't know. Who's gonna fold hope? And, you know, cause she she hold on to the point that she did shot a, a, a pregnant woman, and um, she uh, uh, waited for the longest to finally tell her sister, and she was holding on longer than that. All right, so how is this going to play out? Okay, and that's what ultimately uh, I, I'm I'm going to um, watch and see how all this unfolds now to me that's that was the episode um wasn't a bad episode but to me the way how they produced it and edited it it kind of it was sort of knocked off its flow of previous episodes and i think uh they'll find they're, they're trying to do a little bit I, I don't know maybe they were trying to do something a little different because all the other episodes were edited and produced the exact same way. And like I said uh, in my live stream, Worlds Beyond or Beyond Worlds, whatever you want to call it, it, it's got like pieces of good movies and shows like Lost when they do the flashback scenes, um, you know, of, of both Walking Dead. And, um, one more show, um, and I can't think of it right now. It used to come on Fox on Friday night. It was a science, uh, a science, uh, sci-fi show. I can't think of the name of the show right now, but on my next live stream, on my next review, I will um, let y'all know what, what 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 I was talking about. But yeah, that, in a nutshell, that was the uh, the show itself so sorry i couldn't do a live stream i will upload this uh tomorrow morning it's gonna be a day late because well it's already two days behind because normally i like do these things on monday some things happen along the way in my life particularly last week and it's kind of backlogged to me so but nevertheless yo that was the episode and uh guys tell me what you think great comment subscribe it's your boy. I'm up out of here. Deuces.